much. We got a big interview for you today. Sean Bignall joining us now in studio. If you don't know by now, I said this at six, they're missing too many sports casts if they don't know your name by <laughs> That's now. That's right, exactly, not paying attention. Yeah, Sean's leading uh, how many categories in the nation here? I don't look. Last yeah. <laughs> I checked was jinx. slugging percentage, RBIs, total bases, and oh yeah, home runs. Oh. Not bad. The no. whole nation that is. Not no. just Sun Belt, this is the whole entire nation. Sean, what's it like to um, hold all of those categories right now? It's pretty crazy, you know. Um, just trying to go out every day and help the team out. and. It turns into personal success. It does, but um, usually it's just trying to help us out, get an extra hit, get a you know runs when we need them to put teams away. Usually, you know. Now uh, you guys have right now the best record overall record in the Sun Belt. How confident are you guys heading into conference play this weekend? Oh, we're really confident. Um, the team morale is really high right now. We feel really um, big going into this weekend. Um, putting up some big runs, pitchers are stopping guys, so we feel pretty confident this weekend. Thus you should. Uh, talk to us about why you chose to come to UALR. Um, it was a funny story, you know. Um, out of JUCO, had a couple of D1 offers, and it was always my dream to play Division I. And um, I just came here, it felt right. Um, coaching staff was pretty awesome. The facilities looked great. And um, my, my dad just looked at me and says, well, now you know where you're going to go next year. So I was like, all right, let's go. Yeah. Coach Norwood sold you. I was just saying, yeah. Norwood's the deal. <laughs> yeah, He's a definitely. convincing guy. Pretty convincing. <laughs> He's also a great co-host, too. He's hosted the show before. Yeah. You guys have seen that. <laughs> hey, I think we have some pictures. Yeah. Do we have a picture He looks up familiar. Here? Does he look familiar to you guys at home? Um, do you ever do you get, get this? Do you ever get this? <laughs> Tell me wow. you've heard that before. This Tell is definitely my team nickname. A lot <laughs> is of it really? Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> Campus nickname, actually. Look really? That comparison yeah. right there. Now, did you ever hear that before? Yes. Yeah. Like, uh, my junior year, I dressed up as Tiger Woods for Halloween. Awesome. Yeah. You got the TW hat. Yeah. That's I was great. wearing a blue golf shirt, blue Tiger Woods hat, and some black pants. And I was carrying around a golf club That's all night. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Sean? Now, well, this last interview, I, I uh, talked with you last week. Tell me about your superstitions you have. I thought that was pretty <laughs> hysterical. I'm um, very superstitious, actually. Um, I put my life, left sock on first, then my right sock, then I put my left cleat on first, then I put my right cleat on, <laughs> and then I tie my left cleat, and then I tie my right sure. cleat, and then um, pull up my socks left, right, and then, um, yeah, yeah, everything's then left, right. On deck, you, too, the on deck circle. Yeah, on deck, I put my left batting glove on first, then my right batting glove, then I put on my helmet, then I'd get the bat weight, put it on my bat, then strap up my yeah. left glove, strap up my right glove, take three swings, put the weight away, and then start timing the pitcher. All right, now Not when did that start? One step. <laughs> um, left, right. It started my freshman year, actually, really? of college. You know, I was like, needed a, a thing to relax, you know, to get, you know, mentally prepared for an at bat. So if I do the same thing all the time, it feels like I feel more prepared. So it's just carried on with me. Now because. what if things go wrong? I have to start over. Do okay. you? Yeah. So if someone interrupts yeah. you? Yeah, I always start over. You like, can't step into the box without it being complete, right? Yeah. yeah. So if I put my wrong shoe on first, I'll take both shoes off, put my turfs back on, and then I'll <laughs> start again. I love it. Only baseball players out there would, I love would know that. what he's talking about. I love it. Now, how about a walk-up song? Is that a superstitious thing, too? No. I usually pick something because I'm from Canada, so yeah. I use something to represent Canada. So all four years I've had a different song representing where I'm from to let people know. So you're an amazing baseball player from Canada. I didn't know it stopped snowing there. Yeah, um, <laughs> apparently. It definitely hasn't stopped snowing. <laughs> yeah. Sean, thanks cold. for stopping by. No problem. We appreciate it. Nice. Go get him, Tiger. <laughs> <laughs>